What's up guys? Today I want to talk about something that's been bothering me for a long time. I'm a person that worries about stuff. I'm, I can't be one of those people that just takes it easy and goes, don't worry about it, nothing will ever happen. That's just not me, especially since I'm doing this full time. I'm sure if I wasn't doing this as my primary source of income, I probably wouldn't think about this kind of stuff. Uh, but the one thing that's always bothered me about the whole gaming section of streaming and, uh, and videos is that it's dominated by two places. Twitch.tv dominates live streaming. There is no competitor now that Own3D uh, went out of business. And YouTube dominates videos. Nothing even comes close to even remotely competing with YouTube. At least, at least with streaming, there are a few other streaming websites that they're just not quite as popular for gaming. With YouTube, there is nothing. Like, nothing. You look at Daily Motion and Blip, I mean, they're cool. I, I check them out, but none of them really offer, they don't really offer what I want or what I think would be good for me and my videos. And just, and just looking at the UI, it's not really set up for, for someone like me. So really, the only place for me is YouTube for videos right now. And I hope some sort of YouTube and Twitch competition comes out eventually. I hope there is some competition in the future. And it's not that I don't like YouTube. I love YouTube and I love Twitch, but it's got me worried that that I've got that me and a lot of other people have so much staked in just these two websites. And the fact that there's no competition is kind of bad. So uh, I don't know. Me just being a worry wart, I thought about maybe starting up my own website, but I'm not sure what I'd even post on it to be honest. And I'm not sure why anyone would want to go check it out. But I've, I've been thinking about maybe starting one and maybe just learning how the fuck to do stuff with websites. I don't know. I'm kind of at this point where I'm, I'm like pretty bored right now and I'm not like really working on anything. My only concern with my website would be it would just die when Wildstar comes out because I'd be so busy streaming and making videos about Wildstar that I'd probably just neglect my actual website. So I'm not, really even, I'm not even sure what I'd do. I think my website would honestly just be an extension of my Twitter where I'd just like... Be like, hey, this is pretty cool, check this out. This is pretty cool, check this out. And maybe write, like, a blog post about some dumb shit. I don't know. See, the thing is, is that I'm such a video-oriented guy. All, like, anytime I would make a blog, I would just make a video like this talking about it rather than, than typing it out because I feel like video, video beats the fuck out of vlogs, in my opinion. So, I don't know, guys. What do you guys think? Are you guys, are any of you guys in this YouTube thing like me? Are you worried about this? Because I, I sure as fuck am. Especially considering how finicky YouTube is. With, uh... Like, I mean, you have channels that get taken down all the time. Like, I remember not that long ago, AVGN, the Angry Video Game Nerds channel, just got, like, instantly shut down. And the fact that that can still happen, and the fact that YouTube still has this, like, super archaic three-strike copyright system is... I don't know, man. It's just... It's so finicky and retarded that it's got me worried, so... Uh, if there's any, if there's anything I can tell you out of this video is to follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I know I say that all the time, but the main reason I'm plugging that so much is because if one of my pillars goes down. So basically, right now I've got I've got four pillars, two strong ones, which is my YouTube channel being the strongest and my Twitch stream, and then I've got Facebook and Twitter, which are kind of these not so strong pillars. And I kind of want I I really need to build up my t my Twitter and my Facebook just in case something would ever happen to my YouTube channel or my Twitch stream. I'm just, a, I'm just, I guess I just worry. So please follow me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter. For my mental health, I just need to have some security. I don't know, I just like that feeling of being secure. I, I just hate how finicky shit is on the internet. So I don't know why, I just was thinking about this yesterday. I was, lo I was looking to maybe make up, like, make a, a backup version of all my videos on like daily motion or blip or something and uh none of those websites like they just didn't appeal to me i don't know there's really nothing like youtube which sucks i really hope that something eventually comes out that's like youtube even if it doesn't get as much traffic just i don't know something else fuck in this episode we're going to talk about what is hands down the most defining aspect of wild stars combat aiming now during development we experimented with several different aiming methods traditional